Understand what you mean when you say her and me. We never ever should have played it this real. Got me down under your thumb. Just let me out, just let me have fun. Memory, talk to me. I kind of want to understand what I feel. I love her, I want her. Hey y'all and welcome back for another video. It's Ro here and today I am tackling my downstairs bathroom, doing some mopping and also getting this kitchen together. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. I hope you like it and me enough to hit that subscribe button down below. Also, don't forget to turn on that notification bell so you are notified every time I upload a video. So let's get right into it. All right, y'all. So this is actually a continuation of the After Dark Clean With Me I posted a couple of days ago. This is probably um, two days after that. I need to clean this downstairs bathroom and I also need to mop um the wood floors so by now y'all already know what i do i like saw everything down and then wipe 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 i decided to go ahead and clean these little shelves off i don't think i've cleaned them since i put them up and it's been a few years oh don't judge me y'all but they were good and dusty as you can see by the clothes, I am still one of those people who is going to work during this whole coronavirus outbreak. So I usually mop after Caleb has already gone to bed, but I wanted to go ahead and get done. So that's why it's so much mop water in front of that bucket. He was trying to play in the water. So whenever I mop my wood floors, I try to mop with the grain of the wood or the way the wood flooring is laying so it doesn't get all of those water spots and streaks. But I can't see if you're right here next to me. Something's wrong, wasn't it fun? Is it now we're done? You get dressed, I look a mess. And you tell me to confess. And you tell me to confess. Oh, I don't know what to say, what to do, how to make you see. This is nothing in real life, it might just have been a bad dream You can run, you can hide, but you can't put the blame on me Because you're acting like a volcano Tending to be my savior Nothing you do can save us, save us Because you're acting like So all that stuff on my dining room table is my husband's He just started a new business and he's been using my dining room as his office I'm actually almost tempted to take the dining room table out of there and just turn it into an actual office. Never look back. Now we're over. That's a fact. Raising light. See it all bright. You will never ride back to life. 
So y'all already know when you see these leggings and that t-shirt, it is the weekend. This was Saturday morning, which is when I usually have time to really clean my kitchen. I have been doing my absolute best to make sure I am lifestyling um, and wiping down the doorknobs and the light switches and all that good stuff. Also, don't forget to wipe down your remotes, your game controllers, your cell phones, the tablets, all of that good stuff. Every time I clean my kitchen, I'm always amazed at how much stuff accumulates in this kitchen that's not even supposed to be in here. And that is my soon to be seven year old. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe he's about to turn seven, y'all. <laughs> My soon to be seven year old Christian Akinsili in the camera. In my mind, I'm the guy who never really said an easy goodbye. Always wait till it's too late. Just let it happen, leave it all up to fate. But there is I am actually using my Lifestyle Kitchen Pro to spray down the countertops and I used it on my table as well.
my stove down with the awesome oxygen degreaser and I let it sit for a while I don't think I did that on camera but now I'm just taking my razor and scraping all of that grease off the stove Okay, so I was not expecting this much stuff to be under or behind the stove when I moved it. Look at my face, y'all. <laughs> it was pure shock. You literally don't realize how much stuff falls in between the crack between the counter and the stove. It was it was a mess. I'm just wiping my refrigerator down with a soapy towel just to get some of the food residue and sticky stuff off of the refrigerator, especially the handles. And now I'm going in with my Wayman stainless steel cleaner to clean and polish my refrigerator. to do a better job at cleaning all of my doors especially my doors in the kitchen well all of them actually they get like so dirty around like the knobs and where we're constantly touching them and so when I notice that I'm trying to 
clean them um, as I go along. So if you follow me on Instagram, you would know that my kids just completely destroyed the blinds on this door. So we decided to go to Home Depot and get this privacy film that you see on there. It, like, it lets light in and also creates privacy so people can look straight into your house and we absolutely love it. And that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.